Fabulous Monday. We caught up with our friend Chef Aaron from Kroger to get a new recipe idea for our Monday menu. Here's his take on stuffed mushrooms. Morning, I'm Chef Aaron Neiman and we are at the On the Rhine Eatery above the downtown Kroger right now. And today I am going to make a meatless meal for you. We're going to make a white bean stuffed portobello mushroom. Uh, and it's going to be a little different than a traditional stuffed mushroom. Uh, we are going to make a little bean patty out of white beans, diced poblano peppers. So you need one can of the white beans, one poblano pepper that's diced up, one ear of corn, fresh corn, and then a quarter cup of diced red onion. And we're going to saute that with a little bit of butter in a pan. Um, and I've gone ahead and did that ahead of time because what we need to do is we need to cook that and then let it cool. And we're going to add a third of a cup of Parmesan to it. So you can see it's still a little bit crumbly. But what we're going to do is we're actually going to take that and we're going to smash it into a patty. And as the, the beans are cooking, they're going to be a little bit easier to, uh, to break down. But you can see it kind of forms into a patty really nicely. And I leave some of the beans whole, but all you really need to do is just smash it. So your binder here is going to be your Parmesan and your beans. And uh, that's pretty easy to throw together. So the complicated part is going to be cooking it in your skillet when it's done. Uh, but we're going to put that with a portobello mushroom today. And it's very simply, to clean a portobello mushroom, you can just pop this stem right off. You don't need to cut it. It comes right off. And then you just take a spoon and you're just going to scrape those gills out. So when, it, when you're done, you're going to put a little bit of butter in the pan. And the butter is going to be for both the mushroom and the patty. So that's going to cook for about three minutes on either side. Everything in there is already cooked, but your mushroom and your bean patty should cook for about the same amount of time. As you can see, the Parmesan and the white bean is going to help that brown up a little bit. And I've got the mushroom almost fully cooked, so you just want to transfer your patty on top. And like I said, it's just a little bit different style of a stuffed mushroom. And what you're doing is you're adding texture to this dish. And the texture is going to, going to change the entire way that it eats, but the browning of that cheese is going to add some nice flavor as well. So there you have your stuffed mushroom. And we're going to put that on a bed of arugula, which is going to add a little bit of flavor to it, a little bit of peppery flavor. And we have this balsamic fig glaze. Um, perfect glaze already done for us. And we're just going to drizzle that right on top.